It's not hard to come across a windy day in Chicago. In fact, it might be the most common type of day in the city. This Wednesday morning, La Villita Park welcomes us with a few rays of sun, but also with a wind that sneaks into our clothes. We are here to talk to members of our violence prevention team about some of the work they do in our community. This work revolves around youth and their well-being. La Villita Park is one of the nerve centers of the neighborhood, where youth and families gather to walk, talk, play, and just generally enjoy the space. Each year since the park opened, Enlace has run spring and summer programming here. This has been even more true during the pandemic, as outdoor activities have been key. Victoria Battle is our violence prevention support manager, and her job is to support the development and implementation of programs across the team. I would say the overall goal is just to create a safe space for our young people, you know, somewhere that they could go where they feel safe expressing themselves. During these last few months, the violence prevention team has offered a variety of programs. Some engage the whole family, some bring girls together to focus on their needs, and some integrate arts and culture. All of these programs are the product of internal collaboration across the violence prevention team. With all of us working together, we work better together, you know, like we're stronger together um, than just working alone and working in silos. Elizabeth is also a member of the team. She is a school-based counselor, and in this role, she provides individualized support to high school students. She is also the liaison for Enlace's collaboration with My Block, My Hood, My City. Through this partnership, young people have the opportunity to enjoy group activities in and around the city. I met Jamal Cole, right, who's the founder of My Block, My Hood, just at Green Tomato, like, talking to people about mental health, and he said, oh my god, like, I want, I want your, your kids to be in my program, and I was like, oh, for real? Like, this collaboration has been active for two years, and Mireya, Miguel, and Julie have participated the entire time. These three young people got connected with Eli and Enlace through Community Links, one of the local high schools that hosts school-based counselors. Well, at first, I used to be like, I wouldn't talk to anyone, and I would get like really freaked out with talking to strangers. So after I started talking to Eli, I felt a little more comfortable with like, speaking up to strangers. Mireya also shares her experience with Ellie as her counselor and what it has meant to be a part of the My Block, My Hood, My City group. It was weird in a way because I never really had anyone I could talk to. So like talking to her was really weird for me. But then eventually I got like more comfortable with her. You really helped me like how to point things out. This is a sign of anxiety or like, you know, I don't know how Yeah, to like identify. It. Yeah, identifying things. Mm -hmm. For Miguel, doing different activities with Enlace and My Block, My Hood, My City has been super entertaining and has opened doors to new hobbies such as skateboarding. He has also enjoyed boxing, rock climbing, especially reaching the highest point of the climb, going to the 360 observation deck and the John Hancock Center, and trying different types of food and restaurants. All three agree that everyone should know about these types of opportunities and programs. Everyone should know about this because even though it's uncomfortable at first since you don't know the people that are in it or you might know a few after a while you start becoming really close to the group and you just feel like i don't i don't know how to say it like you welcome. feel like you're really close friends and you feel safe victoria tells us that the violence prevention team intends to continue to offer this type of programming so in the next year like the work is going to be busy and it's going to be, you know, filled with lots of opportunities for our young people. The wind does not give up in La Villita Park, but the sun doesn't stop shining either.